My name is Vincent Chrysostomo. I'm a 51-year-old gay Chamorro male living with AIDS. That's what my bio says. What it doesn't say is that I represent a community of men that HIV almost wiped out in the 80s and 90s. When they told me I was HIV positive in 1989, I didn't know what it meant, what to feel, what to think. They told me Asians didn't get it. They lied. They told me I had six months to live. I lived. And every year after that, I was told I had less than one year to live. I've lived most of my adult life thinking I was dying. Because of that, I have done some things that I might not have done. I've gone some places I might not have gone, and I probably said some things I would not have said. HIV has claimed the lives of colleagues, friends, lovers, the man I married. I don't remember the names, but I see their faces. Why them and not me? Why me? For me, HIV has been about the living. I now accept myself in ways that in 1989 I would not have thought possible. I've learned to live with HIV. I can live with whatever anybody thinks about me. I had the hard conversations I need to have sooner than later. I accept that my family will never change. We love each other, that's what matters. And I can live with the loss of those I've loved. August 11, 2012. The doctor told me I may have cancer. Cancer? How do I live with that? How do I find the strength when I feel like I don't have anything left? I'm so tired. Will I survive? 26 years of living with HIV and AIDS. It's not over yet. What do I know? Death is just another possibility. The pain in my abdomen, the pills I take, the choices I make every day, it's the living. That's what's real.